it is Saturday, October 27th, I think. I really don't know. Um, maybe the 26th? I don't know what day it is anymore, and I'm okay with that. Um, <laughs> I'm going down to Chelsea Yarns because Liz from Trey Liz Color is Power is going to be there, and when your fiber friend comes from Greece, you brave a nor'easter to go hang out with her. So that's what we're doing today. Come along. Okay, I made it to Chelsea Yarns. It's a nor'easter outside. It seems fine when you're in the suburbs, but when you get on the highway, it is really hard to see. So we made it here. Okay, and Traley's Color is Power is having a trunk show, and I want you guys to see all this yarn because it's really, really great. And it's from Greece. How fun is that? Hi! Hi. <laughs> here, and you're here from Greece. Yes. Did you come for Rhinebeck? Yes. Okay. I did. She was here for Rhinebeck and she Rhinebecked with us. Mm -hmm. And now she's having trunk shows all over like the tri state area. Yeah. I'm trying. I was, yeah, I was wondering like how you got the yarn here and she said she sent it here. Yes, I shipped all the things. I really thought that you just like put it in a backpack and took it with Well, you. sometimes well, for festivals I will ship some and I will take some in, uh, you know, uh, with me in my suitcase. But that was like too much. So yeah. I just planned ahead and yes, shipped everything. You've been in a lot of stores. Yeah, but she still has a good amount left, so we're gonna like pick over this. But tell us, tell us about all your your colors and stuff. Okay, so I brought with me some singles and singles with Stelina, and apparently people here really like Stelina. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, and I've never seen singles with Stelina. Really? Very. I think once or twice. So here you go. Oh, I know. So I called this one. Do you trust me? I, I, <laughs> do you trust me? <laughs> well, do you? Do you? I do. Show me more. <laughs> and then uh, yeah, it will depend on the color. Sometimes I, I will either have uh, you know an inspiration or a theme, and uh, some other times I will just dye it, and we'll see you know what it tells me about. The latest one and the newest color is this one. Mm -hmm. It's like a pale bluish one with speckles. And it really was really refreshing for me, and I called it H2O. Oh, because it was refreshing? You just thought it was yeah. like water? That's yeah. a really great idea. Yeah. And then I have also the skits that I did for the fading point. Yeah. And I did I used this kit to do also my so faded. And all of them are Harry Potter inspired. Oh yes! Yes, yes. what's that one called? Oh this Remus Lupin. Lupin. This is Albus Dumbledore, Severus Snape, Rubus, Hagrid, and Sirius Black. Got it. Yeah. And then we have more sock yarn. Let's see. Let's see what's here. Sock yarn. So, so you good. have mojito. Mm. That actually is very reminiscent of a mojito. Yeah. Yeah. This is Gorilla Girls, which is one of my favorite ones. Oh, that is pretty. That's so pretty. And then you have Do You Trust Me again. Look at all this. Those are the Harry Potters in a high twisted merino. Mm -hmm. That I love high twist. It gives such a nice. The stitch definition is really yes, good. Yeah. It's really round and nice. There we go. There we go. Oh, wait. Okay. I think I need to clean my lens. <laughs> yes. Please. This is cream. This is gorgeous. This is a Game of Thrones inspired. Mm, I love this. <laughs> love it. Happy. Yes, and yeah, the whole experience, from, it's like really, really great. I love it. Yeah, you had fun here? Yes, I have to come back. Absolutely. I don't know when, but yes. I need to come back. Absolutely. <laughs> for Vogue, so come back for Vogue in January. Crossing fingers. I know, right? She's asking me about Franny, and let me tell you, Franny was kind of in a bad mood at Rhinebeck. Yeah. She hugged her and let her pick her up. Like, and she was talking to you. Yes, and she yes. kissed me. Yes, yeah, she did, I remember that. I was like, can I give you a kiss? And she Kiss and she, 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 she's very delicate with her kisses too. She's like, yeah, yeah, she's so sweet. <laughs> yeah, she's she was adorable. so excited. Yeah. So I wanted to ask you a couple more questions, and I can't yes. remember any of them because that's how great of an interviewer I am. Oh yeah, wait, here we go. How did you name your company? Ha ha. Well, I'm half French, half Greek, and uh, Trelise in French, Trelise, it's like very Liz. And Treli in Greek means crazy. So it's also very crazy Liz. Very crazy. Yeah. That's actually really great. Yeah. That's a really good explanation. Yes. So it, that's why also the, the logo has the E is a Greek. Wait. 
Oh, I see. It's a Greek E and it has an accent because I'm half French, half Greek. So it got has it. Both. Got it. I got it. <laughs> Actually, the woman who did my logo like is very smart. I was like, I didn't even look at it. I really liked, you know, the symmetry of it. Yeah. And then I was like, oh my god, the E is and it makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> that is really cool. Yes. And my tags are also unique and they're on silk screen printed. And you can also use them as a bookmark. So nothing is lost. Oh really? That's a great idea. Yeah, it is. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it is, of course. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. <laughs> oh my god, you know. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm gonna get this one. I love this yeah, color. Yeah, crimson. Look at that. I really like it. Oh. Before it used to be a bit more like a not pastel, but a bit the transitions Let's of the see. color more like. Uh, Polished, I would say, mm -hmm. but now I like how I'm making it more dramatic. Like yes. it's like more rusty. It has this rustic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. It's earthy. Yes, it's earthy. I love it. I love that one, and I love this one, and Albus Dumbledore, and then this one's fantastical. I yeah. love that one. Yeah, yeah this one, know, seriously. Yeah. yeah. And one of my favorite ones, and apparently people's too, because there's only one left, is a skeleton woman. So cool. So cool. Yeah. Thank you. I'm like, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm really happy that you came to America because I got to meet you. No, like, me too. It was great. I'm so happy that you made it here yeah. today. Yeah, you got I'm to like, meet like, so, so many people. Yes. What was the highlight of your trip? Okay, I have to say that I was really fun girling when I met Christy. Oh, really? Yeah, because uh, I, I went, you know, for the interview and I was like, oh my god. And she was like, oh my god. And I was like, Wait, are we, you know, like having a moment? Like, you know? <laughs> and then it was like, you know, like he, I knew her like all my life. But everybody, like it's been really. You met a lot of people. Yeah, I met a lot of people, but the feeling is like that you already knew yes. them in a way, and that everybody's like like a big hug, you know, a big right. family, and I love that. Isn't it weird? Like you meet people online, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. You know anything about me? You know I touch my hair all the time. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. All right, let's go shopping. Yes. 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 She's showing us what she's taking from Chelsea Yards. Okay, so we're, when you're at Chelsea Yards, you know you have to have a big kahuna. So there were two of them on the table and I was like, oh my god, how pretty are they? You don't really realize in the pictures how big they are. They're huge. And so I was like, oh, those two together. And everybody was like, in a brioche? Or, you know, in something, in color rig? And I was like, no, those two held together for a sweater. That's insane. It's gonna be so good. Yes. So good. Wait, I'm wait, so let's happy. look at it. Look at how. <laughs> yes, I'm so, so happy. I'm so excited. I haven't decided yet, but I'm really, really happy. And also, I don't have to wind it. It's already the cake. Yes. So if you haven't, you should get one. Yes. yes. I'd say so. I, don't, I actually don't have one yet. Yeah, you should. <gasps> look at that. Oh, I have this outside color. I, I have the outside it. color. Look at this. Yeah, and I'm very much into orange and those kind of rusty. But also, my baby, the kind, has a surfing name. Mm -hmm. And I'm all about the blues and surfing and like the big kahuna. It's a surfing thing. Like, I So you're gonna hold them together and make a DK weight sweater? Yes! That's amazing. It's such a good idea. I'm so happy. So <laughs> I hope I enabled some people to get some ideas. Yeah. And here you go. Yes, yeah, there you go. And if you'd like a kahuna of your own, just call yes. Chelsea Yarns and speak to Red Bank Mike. He'll make one for ya. <laughs> exactly! <laughs> I really thought I was gonna get here and there was gonna be no one here. And guess who's here? One of my absolute favorite Fiverr people. One of the club members from the 1979 club. Here she is. Hi. It's Sharika! How's it going, everybody? Good. So this is my um Yeah, what are you working on? Hangover. And you have your sweater on, your Rhinebeck sweater. I have my Rhinebeck sweater on and I am knitting with Trey Liz. <gasps> yarn. That looks so good. I started a what is this called? The so faded. Yeah. Oh wow. Okay. That so, color looks so good knit up. 
like you. I Doesn't love it. it. I yeah. love it. I know. I know. I'm a pink girl, but orange, you can't really fight me. Like this is, you just gotta love it. It's a sister. So. Pink and orange yeah, are sisters. Exactly. Yeah. My next color will be a pink that I'm fading into. That'll be nice. Ooh, that's so, pretty too. Otherworldly yarns. Okay. That I bought when I went to Perth Festival of Yarn. Oh. So you do get around. You are a committed yes. fiber person. I do love it. Yeah. I'm yeah. Me too. I, this is my like travel sweater. So everything I bought in Perth Festival will be in this sweater. Oh, that's sweet. So, yeah. I like awesome. that. Aw, I'm so glad you're here. It was such a good surprise. I know. I'm so happy I finally made it to the show. I know. Oh, so this is the first time you're here? In here. <gasps> you're a virgin Chelsea Yarner? Yes, I am. Uh, I just have to make sure I get some lux before I leave here. Yes, you do. Because, I mean, it's a necessity. You gotta you get some lux. You can't come all this way and not get No, you have to. So. <laughs> well, we'll check in with you in 10 minutes and see if you're done with the sweater. See, okay. Okay. I'll have sleeves by then. Oh, you That's probably fair. will. You probably will. <laughs> Knowing you. In case you wonder why I'm taunting Bring her about that, she finished her Rhinebeck sweater like in like what like a week or two. It was a it was ten days. sweater. Was ten, ten days. days. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah. What happened? <laughs> That's why. We were all watching on Instagram with like bated breath, like, is she gonna finish the sweater? And she did, and she got to Rhinebeck with half a sleeve to go and finished it the night before. Yeah. That's commitment. This girl, 1979 Club. Me, her, and Christy. Yep. Yeah. We all love Shira, Princess of Power. Yeah. That's why now her new name is Shamazing. Shamazing! <laughs> She's amazing. Okay, I'll draw them. Yes. 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 She's also a graphic designer by day. <laughs> Branded by me. She's amazing. <laughs> I love my fiber friends. As I said, I thought there was going to be no one here, guys. The table. Full. So they did a little rearranging here at Chelsea Yarns, which is why I walked in, I was like, where is the table? So the table's in the back now, which is really nice, because the front of the store has all of this fiber goodness, and you don't have to walk around the table. And the people knitting don't feel like you're getting in their way anymore, and it's just, it's a great, great shop. So I've showed you the shop like a thousand times, but I think we have to look at the lux, because that's what we do when we're here, right? love about the store which I just discovered actually is they have paper copies of a lot of the great patterns that are out right now so if you are not someone who puts your credit card online and you want these patterns you can come here and get these really beautiful they're on like cardstock and they're really nice and you can just keep them you know so they've got Caitlin Hunter patterns she's got Andrea Mowry patterns like she's got the weekender and boho blush which is the next one that I'm making. This is the next one that I'm making. Boho blush. And um, she's got the throwback. And so um, if you, again, are not someone who puts your credit card online and you want patterns, you can come here to get them. And they have them. They're beautiful. They're printed out and they're like, they're almost like a keepsake. So just something else I love about this store. So I have been hanging out with Shamika and Liz and I'm really, really having a great day, even though it is disgusting outside. But we are <laughs> again shopping in Chelsea Yarns and I can't come here without buying stuff. And I thought, all right, I'll get some stuff from Liz because like, you know, it's from Greece and I don't often have access to it, but I've got Spin Cycle, I've got Humid, I've got... All right, well, let's start with this. This is what I'm getting from Liz. <gasps> Guys. They're not a Brio duo, but they are gorgeous. And they're gonna be great stash enhancement, right? And then I'm going to get these three colors of Spin Cycle to stash because I love Andrea Mowry's patterns and I never wanna buy like a load of Spin Cycle at once. So I'm starting to just hoard it and then I'll be able to pick from it. And it's not like it's something that wouldn't de-stash super easily. So it's like an investment, right? 
And then I found these two colors because I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do with my um, short sleeve cipola. I know I have that berry color, but these two colors, look at that. So we gotta figure out what goes with that berry color. And I think these are really pretty. So I'm gonna take those home also. <laughs> and then I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna de-stash. But right now, we're gonna watch Liz picking out a new hat pattern. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm trying on mismatched socks. Yes, and I'm. Why do you have mismatched socks on? They are like that. <laughs> they don't match. They don't match your outfit. I love Adidas gazelles. I wear them all the time. And I'm just. You're picking out a new hat pattern. See, she's all yes. the orange. That hat is called the Co uh, Cobra. Like the Cobra hat. Yeah. That one. It's Caitlyn Hunter. Curse is Caitlyn. It's a good hat. Well, That's a good hat. Uh, it's, it's so one here and when you're at Chelsea Yarns, it's the perfect, or two perfect or way to pick up with your shelter. Isn't that pretty? I love this one. Yeah, that's her yarn, right? And it's held with yes. um, mohair. Yeah. Yeah. I love it. Which one is that one? That hat. Yeah, you have to make that one. Or I will leave with that one. Like Just leave with it, yeah. <laughs> Just leave with it. So all of us are starting to pack up. We always like to close the joint when we come here, right? Look at her, she's still knitting. I have sleeves in. We just challenged her to knit it to comes in four days. <laughs> I actually have to go to work, you know? No. So, you know, call in sick and knit your Tecumseh. See, and Miriam's back there learning brioche from Trey Liz. Yeah. Miriam's not at the table. Yeah, she's not at the table. She's over, the, she's over there. But she did, she learned brioche from Liz, so um, stay tuned. So we're at Chelsea Arns and everyone's packing up, and you know, we probably should have left because I think it closed like probably an hour ago. But this okay, so is, introduce yourself. Um, hi, I'm Corina, and uh, you can find me at Cory Cat on Instagram. <laughs> and look what she knit. Do a twirl, do a twirl. It's the Shoe Suey Shrug. By So Su Knit. Is that how you say it? Su Shoe Suey? Shoe Suey. I think yes. so, right? Yes. <laughs> so I met So Su at EYF. She's like the nicest person oh, in the world. Amazing. But she is so talented, and these patterns are insane. Like, yes. look at this. I had such a fun time knitting it. And I'm so happy I can finally wear it. Yeah, look at that. Do a twirl, do a twirl. Yeah. And the great thing is it's totally reversible. It's so good. It's so good. It's so good. So how long have you been knitting? Oh, okay. a long time. Really? Maybe, I think I learned when I was eight or nine, mm -hmm. and then I've been pretty much knitting since then, and so that would make it over 10 years. <laughs> oh, okay, all right, because I'm like looking at it, and I'm like, not everyone can do this level of brioche. Like, no, really, can I just touch this? Yes, please. please. Thank you, look at this. Guys, that is beautiful. I love this shrug, but I will never be able to knit it because I don't have the discipline. How long did it take you? Uh, probably two and a half months. Yeah. yeah. The end is a over 400 stitch I cord bind off, but it's so worth it. It's like that home stretch, and then you have. That's probably the only part of the shrug I could do. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted you guys to see it because that's the kind of stuff that you can turn all this beautiful yarn into, and it's incredible. And her her braid matches. Look. Yeah. There you go. So you guys can see her. She'll probably be walking around Vogue. So there you go. Customer spotlight done. <laughs> Amazing. Hey Miriam, you learned brioche today. I did. I learned brioche today. How I'm do you so feel? Excited. How do you feel? How do you feel? I feel magnificent. Accomplished. Look at this. Look at this. I got the <gasps> yeti. The fetti. Look, she did it. She's got the fetti Ready? in one hand and the brioche in the other. Amazing. I don't know. I kind of like my fetti. <laughs> I actually love your fetties. <laughs> no, look at that. Look at the color. That was not this, fetty, is, this one actually may be a real one. This was Miranda's. <laughs> not one of the weird ones I order that come from China <laughs> and take six weeks to get here. This one, yeah. Miranda. That might be a real one. This could be the real one. There deal. are enough real ones around here. You could just <laughs> slip one in your pocket. No one would know. Yeah. So fun. So, Congratulations. Thank you. High five. Yes. <laughs> okay. I'm so excited. Have a good night. You too. Okay, bye. bye. Take bye. Mariah with you. Bye. Take her with you. She doesn't know how she's getting home.